Hey y'all, Char Silk with United Country Exploration Realty with my trusty sidekick, Matt Brooks. I was on vacation, I'm back, so we're at a new episode of Cocktails and Real Estate and we're in Eric at 522 South Elm. Look at this, corner lot, three lots actually. This home has a storm shelter and a shop, Matt, can you believe that? Not at all, and it's a great looking house. This outside looks really good condition. Metal roof, all kinds of stuff. Cute little patio right there too. Yeah. It's got a chain link fence all the way around, so you're all set. Let's go in here and make a drink and take a look. We are making sweet tea margaritas here today, and then we're gonna go take a look at this house. So Char, why don't you go ahead and make us a sweet tea margarita? So since I've been in the South, we had to have sweet tea, cause you know, everything they make in the South is sweet. So I went and bought red diamond sweet tea, put just a little bit in there. Got to make one for Devin, you know, she's our support staff. Oh, Matt, your drink isn't going to be good. Mine will be. Little bit of sweet tea, triple sec. And then tequila. Of course, I would like more in mine. Matt just gets a little, you can't trust him when he gets a little tequila. We're gonna put just a little bit of lime juice in it, just because. And then we're gonna garnish it, because we are super fancy again. We're gonna garnish it here. Y'all, I'm really thinking about becoming a bartender in my next life. Ready? Oh, and look at this, we even have new straws now. And here we go. Let's get our episode started with the kitchen, my favorite place. But look at this. I don't think we've had one of these on the show yet, no. Matt. Look at that. They don't do this. You don't see these very often. You do see them in some older homes, of course. You don't have brand new cabinets in here, but they are very, very well maintained. Yes. They do not look old at all. I mean, super well maintained. Even, you know, a lot of times by the sink, you see a lot of discolorations and stuff. You don't really see that here so much. Lots and lots of cabinets in here. I mean, just plenty of storage. Look at this gas stove. It's relatively new. It stays with the house. Look at that black uh, French door style refrigerator. The sink and the faucet are new. Char cell coming on the fridge. Isn't that beautiful, guys? Isn't that beautiful? In, uh, we also have tiled floor here, but wait till you see the rest of the floor in this house. To me, Matt, it's probably the best thing about it. Oh, it is. It's beautiful. In the formal dining room, which is kind of rare nowadays, guys, to have a formal dining room, but it is huge. I don't know if you can really tell by our video, but it comes off of this cute, cute little bar area where if you had a family or if you were hosting the holidays, this would be perfect because you could serve and still put bar stools around here. Do you know where Matt went? I just came through this pocket door right here that leads to the hallway with the bedrooms and another bathroom. Hey, this house has a lot to offer. Look at the hardwood floors. Yes. I mean, just look. I think we could do the whole video over just the beautiful hardwood floors. And they're not normal hardwood. They're not like the big white planks. Yeah. They're like small planks. They're something you don't really see a whole lot. Not only is this house just shy of 1,900 square feet with a two-car garage. Guys, look at this laundry room, mud room. I mean, I've lived in houses with smaller bedrooms than this whole room right here. And let's take a look over here at this pantry. This, as if you didn't have enough storage in there already. In the kitchen, you also have this massive walk-in pantry. Look at all the stuff you can put in here. Your bigger items like your crock pots, your blenders, your Nesco cookers, whatever you want to in here. Plenty of room for that stuff. Your pressure cookers. I see air fryers out on everyone's cabinets these days. That can fit in here and not take up cabinet space. Check out this living room right here. This is not just your only living room either. You have a whole other living room right over there on the other side of the kitchen. So you have two living spaces in here, plenty of room for family gatherings. You've got that huge dining room. This house is great for entertaining. 
And look at this. This baby is a cast iron heating source. So if the power does go out, gas heat. Hey, I want to recap on this house because I don't want you to overlook it. It's two bedroom, two bath, but it has this bonus, as Matt likes to call it, flex room that you could easily convert to a bedroom mm -hmm. or a study or whatever you really need. Has access outside to the storm shelter and the shop that has two overhead doors, guys, two. Guess what else, Matt? It has a man cave in it. Again, super huge yard, chain link fence, two car garage. Exterior is in really great condition out here. So you don't want to miss out on this one. Don't forget it has a shop, it has a storm shelter, it has hardwood floors, and it's on a corner lot. Everyone, it has the most beautiful old trees on it. Give me a call if you want to see this one here in Erie, 580-450-0697, or you can call Matt if you want to, it's okay. You can call the office also, 580-225-3699. Make it a great week, everyone.